It's me, Maha. And me, Fabia. And today we are going to talk about a very serious matter, which is coronavirus. Coronavirus is the most dangerous virus, and it started from China and then went to Iran, and now it is it is affecting many countries. Fabia, do you know about this virus? No, no, Maha, I don't know. Please tell me. Coronavirus is the most dangerous virus. It has affected many countries, and today. I will give you some proportions how we can save ourselves from this virus. So if you want to see, let's see. First thing is to wash your hands with warm water and soap regularly. And I'm going to give you all a small demo which will show you all that why washing your hands is important. And he is my younger brother and I'm going to give him also some information that why do we have to wash our hands. Just suppose that this is a virus water and dip your finger in it. Is there any um, pepper or virus in your hand? No. Yes. 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 Ah. Okay. Now put, dip it in soap water and now see is there any uh, Pepper in your hand? No. No. And now dip it in this water. Oh my yeah! God! Just look, all the uh, pepper or virus is running away. Yes. So this is because wash. This is just look at this, and now you would have come to know that washing our hands is very important. So guys, now let's go and wash our hands because there are some steps also to wash our hands, and I'm going to show you all. That how do we have to wash? To show you all the steps which you have to do, and Fabia, you note note down all the steps, and then I'm going to ask you. Okay. So the first step is to wash our hands and wet them. Then the second step is to take soap, and then we are going to do it like like this until foam appear. Now you can see foams are coming and now the third step is to do like this all the germs which will be in the in our thumb will go away and then with the other hand also now what we have to do is we're going to, with our fingernails we're going to do it like this we're going to make circles and same with the other hand okay and the last step is to do like this all the germs which will be over here will go away and now we're going to wash it with water nicely we're going to wash it with water and now Fabia you also do it the same way the yeah, same way I did. Have to do it like this until foam. Do it like this. Good. So as the further steps we have to do while we are washing our hands. Ma, where is towel? No, we don't have to use towel. We have to use tissue papers. So tissue papers.
that we have to avoid touching our eyes, nose and mouth, especially with our unwashed hands. Another thing is that we have to avoid close contact and we have to keep distance while we're talking with anyone, especially with the people who are sick. especially at public and crowded places. Uh -huh. We can't go to the park also? No, we don't have to grow, go anywhere. If it's an emergency, so use a mask like this and mm -hmm. take a small sanitizer in your pocket and use it after every 10 minutes. Buy these masks and sanitizers for your helping hands also. Give them and share these precautions with them also. So that they are also fine and you are also fine and stay healthy. As we don't have to touch any metal surfaces or things and if we are touching it, we have to use this sanitizer which should be in your pocket always. And we don't have to shake hands with each other and we have to do elbow shake in cricket matches or in WHO meetings as well. They are not shaking hands with each other but doing elbow shake and I hope you will follow these rules which we have told you clean and stay healthy. May Allah yeah. save all of us from this virus and keep watching Maha and Fabi and like our video, share it with your friends, family, relatives and Take this matter serious and follow all the rules which we have told you and subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for all our notifications. So that Maha and Fabi is
it had been finished, yes. it was pretty much mess. Yes. And now, you see everywhere, it's clean. Just one helpline. 
Fabia has used her helpline and this one will go she had just one helpline and she has used it now she cannot use what it what is this it's small and it's easy but this Fabia cannot do it if she sells seashells I can do she sells she sells she shells she shells she shells she shell. Okay, done. Fabia did it. I just said it the opposite that Fabia cannot do it, but Fabia did it. So and Fabia I have three, three points. points. I have I'm zero points. points. Now it's my turn. I don't know where it will come. Uh, you pick it. What is this? Okay, my English. I know all the rounds. I got English. Now it's very deep. No, I got Urdu. It's Urdu. It's Chandu ke chachi. Yani Chandu ki chachi. Ko chand raat pe, chandi chok pe, chandi ki chok pe. Let's start. This tongue twister came to Fabiha. But she used the help line and did it. So now this tongue twister I had. But I didn't want to use the help line. I'll say it three times. No, you don't want to use the help line. Okay. Okay. I don't want to use the help line. Chandu ke chachi ne chandu ke chachi ko chandi raat pe chandi chok pe chandi ki chamas se chutni chutai. Chandu ke chachi ne chandu ke chachi ko chandi raat pe chandi chok pe chandi ki chamas se chutni chutai. Chandu ke chachi ne chandu ke chachi ko chandi raat pe chandi chok pe chandi ki chamas se chutni chutai. I got a point. I have two points. I have three points. I have one point back from Fabia. The last chip is left now. And is this is my favorite. I want to get it. But ice cream, you scream, you scream. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Ice cream, you scream, we scream for ice cream. Oh. Okay, I Fabia can... did not do it. Fabia said it wrong. But then also, Fabia is the winner for this challenge because Fabia have three points. No, I have, have two points. The Okay, two chairs are left yes. right now. The round is not completed. Two chairs are left. So now it's my turn. Let's see. Okay, I will throw it up and you are at every whichever chair will fall down. I will pick that. Both okay. came down. I'll pick any one of them. Okay. It's an Urdu tongue twister. Kachi paper pakka papita pakke paper pe kacha papita. I'll say three times. Kachi paper pakka papita pakke paper pakka papita. Kachi paper pakka papita pakke paper pakka papita. No, I said it wrong. You said wrong. I'm like I said pakke paper pakka papita. It's really, really, really small. Kacha paper pakka papita. Kacha Babar Paka Babar, Kacha Babar Paka Babar, Kacha Babar Paka Babar, Kacha Babar Paka Babar, Kacha Babar Paka Okay, done. So, Fabia is the winner of this, of this challenge. As Fabia has four points, I have just zero. Three points. So, Fabia is the winner for this round. So, if you like our challenge, like, share with your friends. And subscribe to our channel. And please give us your feedback. Whatever challenge you want us to do. And give your feedback to us. Okay. So now let's meet you all in our next challenge. Bye. with a challenge that is how well do, do we they know each other so basically how this works is that I'll, I'll be asking them 10 questions about each other so I'll say a question like um, what is your what is her full name so she has to tell her full name and she has to tell her full name and then after all the questions are done We'll see who got the most right. And the one who got the most right will be the winner.
I'm just seven. So let's start. And I'll disappear like. Oh. Now she is gone. So guys, now let's begin with our challenge. And our first question is now here. Okay. What is her full name? Yeah, full name is Sayyida Maha Abbas Nakhvi. And her full name is Sayyida Pabya Abbas Nakhvi. Okay. What is your exact age? <laughs> I'm sorry. Your is seven. Your is ten. So okay. guys, now we'll get... Question number three. Well, who is her best friend? Your best friend, Mariam. And her is Amal and Abbas. Okay. You have to choose one. Um, Abbas. Okay. So guys, I'm really much nervous and excited too. Let's see. What is what is her favorite color? Her is pink and purple. Her is pink and golden. Question number five. What is your favorite food? Your is lasagna. Your is soup. I think so. Mm -hmm. Time for time for question number six. What is her favorite fruit? Your is all the fruit, I think. Okay. And her is, I think, so pomegranate. Okay. Question number seven. Whom do she love the most? Teacher, friends and family. Okay. What is your favorite hobby? What is her favorite hobby? Your is the one making the design or making the design. Okay. Playing. Okay. I'm not sure what that is. In which grade are you? You are really really much in grade five. She's in grade two. And we are in five. Okay. Last question. What is your class teacher's name? Your is Miss Nazish and your is Miss Anila. Okay. So guys, it was the last question. Yes. yes. So it's the time for our scorers. Now let's see who was the winner yes. of this challenge. So I'm back. Both of them have tied, so I think there should be a bonus round for this. And bonus round will have two points. I'm going to ask them a bonus question and if they say the correct answers, they win. So, I will be asking them a question about me and whoever guesses it right will be the winner. It's a really, really, really easy question. What is my age? She got it! And the winner of our challenge is Fabi! Guys, if you like our share video, like, like share, share, and subscribe, subscribe to the channel. And don't forget to press the bell the icon for all the notifications. notifications. So, Ma, Ma and Fabi A A. <laughs> Bye!
let's start. Three, two, two one, start. We just have 15 seconds. Okay.
so let's start. So I am singing the poem on friends forever. So let's start. Make new friends, but keep the old. Those are silver, but these are gold. Friendships that have stood the test. Time changes, but they are surely the best. People who have true friends are such a This was my today's poem about friends. If you like it, so please tell me in the comment section and like our video. Follow these people, subscribe them, and give them some love. So today we are going to ask her some questions. So without wasting our time, let's start. So many who are your hobbies? Okay, my hobby is first of all sports. I love sports. I play football, basketball, and sometimes netball. But mostly, I play football. So, so yeah. have you ever won a tournament of football? All the time! Like, I'm not joking, I'm not being like that. Like, we have, I have a lot of tournaments. We have a lot of Not just me, my team is very good. I study in the city school that I have And we have an amazing team. And especially my seniors. They are but I'm very happy with, it, with our achievements. We have a lot And yeah, guys, I have nationals we can as a sin player. That is the like biggest thing that happened to me matlab mere liye bahut badi baat thi and i'm so thankful to these girls ki wo mujhse mere bare mein puchte hain aaj tak aisa kuch bhi nahi hua hai koi mujhse nahi puchta ki maine kya kiya but i'm really thankful to these girls so my young what your age my age is 14 and in your yeah. school do you study i study in the city school darsha campus and in which class are you i am in 9th grade like i have passed 9th grade now i'm going to 10th grade what's your lucky number? I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know. And your favorite animal? I really don't like animals. I don't know why, but I like dogs. Puppies. Do you like any birds? No. I I'm not that fond of animals at all. Puppies or birds? I don't know. Red rose any day. So mine's also a rose. Yeah. My tulip. 
My favorite subject is business studies. I am I have started my O levels. That's why I have business account. I have taken commerce. Basically. So, yeah. And the last thing, what's your favorite color? My favorite is red. So guys, this was our today's video in which we question and answers. This is question and answers with Madhya Madhi. If you like, like it, like, share. Amazing. Give them some love and see you guys in the next video. Till then, have a good time. Bye. Bye.
at the jumping castle and please we came again so guys please give your suggestions to us and give your feedback which video should we make next and see here is Ali Nafi <laughs> just ignore him and the joker is also here so this was the joker and so how many of you have come to Lal Kira? Please tell me in the comments and how many of you have not came come here so please try to come with your family or friends it's a beautiful place to come and eat the dinner and see the waterfall also it's really beautiful so, please give your suggestions to us that which video should we make next. And so, this was my today's video. Guys, the cake is coming. And it's Nava's birthday. So, let's wait for it. It's just coming. Okay, it's here. Okay. The cake is here. You can see it's here. It's here. You can see it. 